Now, before we start, the title is of course a joke. Shadow Square is a veggie boy, mostly for personal beliefs and partially to ensure that plants don't rise up and kill us all. Because that's a thought that keeps me awake in the night. Anyway, chickens are fun and tasty, right? And hens? Hens are cool too. What's the coolest thing a hen does? If you said lay eggs, you're right. Now it does take time, of course. On average, a hen lays an egg a day. Pretty cool. The horny bastards. Now, what about these hens? A hen and a half lays an egg and a half in a day and a half. How many eggs does one hen lay in one day? Now, this may be confusing, but let's break it down. 1.5 hens lay 1.5 eggs in 1.5 days. How many does one hen lay in one day? From a research, you'd say one. Well, you're wrong. These hens are both lazy and imaginary. So you should book up your ideas and use math. My least favorite thing. Let me show you how it's done. If 1.5 hens lay 1.5 eggs in 1.5 days, one hen would lay one egg in the same amount of time. 1.5 days. Now, if one hen lays one egg in 1.5 days, using division, it means that one hen would lay two thirds of an egg in a day. So the answer is two thirds of an egg. Now, you may say, oh shadows where you handsome, handsome man. If the hen only lays two thirds of an egg in a day, then it hasn't actually laid an egg. And this is the wrong answer. Now, I'm not saying you're wrong. And I'm also not saying Anon's wrong because I asked him and he also said that, and he scares me. However, what I am saying is this is a mathematical question, not based in the real world, because who can own one and a half hens? And why would they lay an egg and a half in a one and a half days? And why is it so damn specific? This is just a fun math problem. And if I see any of you sick fucks in the comments tell me about this one time where you cut a hen in half, I swear to Jesus you will not live to see the end of this day. So there you have it. If you ever want to ruin your divorce court hearing and lose custody of your children, maybe ask the judge about one and a half hens.